is next. You guys, it's on the set list. And it's, are you ready? Are you ready? It's about an Irish man. <laughs> an Irish man named Jimmy Kelly. Now, this is a true story. Jimmy Kelly, 1849, during the gold rush in San Francisco. But what happened is, the, the ships were coming from all over the world, and the crews of the ships would abandon the ships once they got to San Francisco Harbor, and they'd head up to the Sierra Nevada mountains, right? And uh, the ships would get stuck in the harbor, and they had no idea how to get the ships back out of San Francisco Harbor. Did I mention San Francisco Harbor? I can't yeah. So, Jimmy Kelly, the Irishman, was paid in advance by the various shipping lines to make sure that the crew never made it up to the gold rush, Sierra Nevada mountains. And Jimmy Kelly would stand at the end of the pier and he'd go, How's it going, lads? Welcome to America. Drinks are on Jimmy Kelly. And he'd send him off up to his pub called Jimmy Kelly's. Henceforth, by the way, that is where we get the term peer pressure from. <laughs> How many people know that? I did not know that. Yep. So he would send him up to his pub, and there was a woman there called Mrs. Pickett, and she would spite the liquor. This is a true story. She would spite the liquor with laudanum, chloral hydrate, and opium. Yeah. And they would pass out, and they'd wrap them up in blankets, and they'd bring them back down to the harbor and put them back on the ship, right? And they woke up the following morning on the ship. And then before they knew it, they were on their way to China. And that's the expression to get Shanghai'd. Have you heard that expression before? Yeah. You've heard that expression? So we were doing the research on this guy, and we're thinking, how the hell do we get Gold Rush, Sierra Nevada, Jimmy Kelly, Mrs. Pickett, uh, laudanum, chloral hydrate, opium, into one song. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen of the United States of America, you're welcome. <laughs> Take that, Beyonce. <laughs> so here we go. The song is called Shanghai Kelly. And it's written from the point of view of one of the guys that just woke up. Here we go. <laughs> 